All Go right. On. We're here. Uh, Ark's Pokemon Draft League, joined by two special guests. One, team manager, and uh, second, uh, Mr. President. Would you guys like to introduce yourselves? After you, oh. uh, Mr. President. Go! Really? You're going to give me? Okay. Um, yeah, I'm the president. I've been president for going on about, let's say, a good two months. And I know a lot. I know what else is there to say? I know a lot when it comes to Pokemon. It's kind of my field. I I know black from white, you know, it gets it gets complicated out there. So that's why I'm here to look over things, make sure everything goes smoothly, see what mistakes were made and see what we can do about them. So let's get a good game in. Amen. Uh, thank you, Mr. President. And sorry for interrupting you. Um, Didn't ask. Your tenure over the past couple weeks here has been has been great. So I apologize. Um, I'm the team manager and coach, as you know. I'm responsible for babysitting Quincy and stopping him from making the idiotic mistakes. Um, I will take credit for all his success, as I've, you know, demonstrated in the past videos. Uh, and I will be taking credit for this week. That's a good sign. Yeah, absolutely. And uh, it all know. flows to me, though. Yeah, in the it's a hierarchy. Um, so. And I'm on the top. <laughs> We got some yeah. competition at uh, Laddie Daddy HQs, but you guys know me. I'm Quincy Stotts, and we're here to review our week one game against no week two game against well, the Wid call it Midwestern Warriors. I'd call it more more like um, intentional deniability. Inten I don't know what that means. That's what I'd call it. Um, game. We're up against the Midwestern Warriors. Team manager, I think you know the Midwestern Warriors. They're ranked number 18 in the power rankings, and we are, like, number 10 or something. But, um, honestly, they gave a uh, little bit of a run for our money, as the uh, Mr. President knows. Oh, all too well. Yeah, Embarrassing. absolutely. Embarrassing. It to be president of, of... To be president in such a... Yeah, it's embarrassing. Uh, of all your of all your six months here, that, that must have been the most embarrassing moment. Oh, sure. oh man. Oh, man. Like... I've only been in this for about like a week and already it's been just throwing me off. Like really, I've never seen such unprofessionalism. Never seen this sport disgrace so much before, but we're going to change that right now, aren't we? Yeah. Yeah. We better. We, right, we were a little up. unprofessional last week, but you're this gonna, week we're, shape up. we were a lot more professional this week, I think. Yeah. Agreed. Yeah. Um, let's talk about the team. You guys know the team. Let's talk teams. We let's brought, let's talk, let's talk teams. We brought Evie this week. You know Eevee, why, good choice. You know why I like Eevee? No. Two times stab on all normal type moves. That means we can Awful stack stat. up. Awful stat, but yeah, okay. Uh, <laughs> yeah, normal type is kind of garbo. But we got quick attack, double edge, and return. All big hitting moves. One of them priority, and then wish for some healing. I mean, if you're a new player like yourself, yeah. Mm-hmm. It's, it's a good rookie build, I think. Yeah. Uh, I like the priority move. That came in clutch more than once. Priority moves do more often than not come in pretty clutch as we've seen a couple times uh and next we have not so much a clutch mon but our uh our tier one of the of the pick week pharaseed he's got iron barbs as all good pharaseeds do and uh, a bunch of really just annoying moves leech seed ingrain spikes and stealth rock totally unbalanced totally unbalanced players yes. these days they, they like to manipulate the system they, they, they do what's called uh cheese you understand but uh, mm -hmm. we're better than them. We combat this. Pharaseed is the anti-cheese. Uh, that is very mm -hmm. true. And we made great use of the spikes this week. That was we got a lot of damage off those. So amen, we dude. Did. I love You're spikes. welcome, Quincy, for suggesting that. You you did you did suggest that to me, in my dreams, as you as you normally do. Uh, next. Next we got, up, we got scoliosis. Scoliosis. That that is solosis. Yep. No. Oh. Um. Oh wait. It says here in my notes that it's supposed to be skull, skull You know, I think it one. it might have been, but um, already off to a bad start. But go whatever. Ahead. Uh, we're running tripper, trick room again because trick room is pretty cool. Trick room is good. Trick yeah, room is good. It it helped us get a little bit uh better differential last week, so we didn't get absolutely wiped, uh, in my disgraceful gameplay. And disgraceful. you know, he's just Solosis is pretty cool. He's got a lot of special attack. He's got a lot of good moves, um, and I want him to set up Rain Dance for Totodile over here. That he does, Quincy. That he does. A, 
to uh, dampen the power of this the Midwestern Warriors Ponyta, which could be a force to be reckoned with, but also to just give Totodile a nice little buff. What do you guys have to say about that little strat right there? Well, I think our players are going to improve greatly from this. From this, if we don't, um, if we don't uh, continue with the, you know, the the, uh, the aid program, you understand what I'm saying? Like a certain <laughs> substance program. The aid program. Then I think our, our our minds need to be in the right spot. That's why we use what we use. Does that make sense? That's why the rate we have the rain dance. Team manager. Right. I I agree. I concur. Mm-hmm. Uh, I don't want to talk about my excellency. Yeah, I don't want to talk about Nidoran, obviously. Honestly, we don't need to talk about Nidoran. Yeah, I don't want to. No, no more. No more needs to be said. No, uh, I, I off put, of Nidoran. I put off of Nidoran right now. Off right. of Nidoran right <laughs> you're now. You're right, right. Off. We're going. We're going to Geo Dude. Geo Dude. Uh, Rocky Good Hillman. Pick. Great pick. Man, might I just say Geo Dude might have just been the best pick of this trimester. I think. So. <laughs> I think so. Brilliant. And Brilliant you know what makes pick. him even better? Rocky Helmet. And what that more means... could you ask for? That means he's almost basically a Pharisee clone. This in my is book. this him right there, and I, pun intended. He he cements us as a valuable team, and we are on the road to unstoppability. He is a sturdy right rock there. to stand on, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and that is my opinion. Right. Yeah, and I just want to say, considering the length of tenure of Mr. President here, going on you know mm -hmm. five years, the fact that he said yeah, that was a good pick a long... that means something, right? Mm -hmm. it, uh, it holds credence. Yeah. If the if Mr. President does. stands behind Geo Dude, then so do I. Right. And if I see Rally you misuse him, I you'll know it. You know, mm -hmm. you'll know it. I'm an expert at all things Pokemon. I know things like this. This is my this is my field. You know. Absolutely. This is my uh, thing. Do can we take a quick vote to head over to the replay viewer? The replay I, viewer. Uh, I concur. I, I vote yay. I vote let's move over. Yeah, let's move over. Um, I vote we just stick around. Oh no, we're moving over. It's I late. wanted to talk about Totodile. Okay. Totodile doesn't need any talking about. Well, I guess we like losing then. <laughs> In all reality, Totodile's here to just murder Ponyta. I think that's about as much as I want to say about him. You're paying me, so I'm uh, I'm gonna agree with you. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so looking at this end um, of this match, this uh, team lineup here from the Mid Midwestern Warriors. Uh, Spring Pig, not a good choice right off the bat. Spring Pig, <laughs> spring get rid of Spring Pig. pig. Yeah. Get rid we, of Spring Pig. I don't want Spring Pig around. Um, you have uh, you have Duck. I mean, what is this guy thinking? Duck? Duck. Are you serious? Yeah. I... Why is he there? He's, like, why he's is... gonna duck us, I guess. I guess. Last week we Better got than licked. Better getting licked. Yeah, last week we got That's licked. That's I true. do not want to get ducked this week. I mean, that is true. On. All, all said and good, you know, what's our opening play here, do you guys think? Because I know the well, play. Well, if I'm as good an analyst as I say I am, and I like to believe I am, because mm -hmm. I have like two months of experience, in the presidential field and that's not counting all of, like the you know esl gsl it pro goes, games it I've goes won. back it goes back i've won so many tournaments in this in this nonsense now if you were a smart player which i know you are you're going to open up with eevee and you're going to you're going to do a flame attack on the spring pig and that's going to cement you as <laughs> a valuable opponent that's i would what's like happen. to do a flame attack that's team what's manager happen. This is all fresh for you. Um, I don't believe it is actually. Oh, it's not. Yeah, I was the one who was, you know, controlling you like Ratatouille in your hat, making That's you right. win. You were, you were behind me, um, uh, making my every move. But... Both emotionally and physically. Yes. Um. Anyway, I'm thinking. As the uh, the the semi somewhat pilot for the Laddie Daddies, you know, honestly, I don't remember. We opened up with Nidoran. Nidoran. Yeah. Okay. That's a poison be poison I, I, matchup, I boys. You... Mm -hmm. Okay. Good. 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 And uh, now, coughing can't really do anything here. to us. Uh, and Nidoran. Well, I know we can do a, a good little damage on him, but I think we switch out to Pharaoh Seed right Goes away. Goes into Pharaoh Seed. Good choice, as always. Picking just... the right players, getting yeah. to it. I want to set up. You seem like you have a firm understanding i want to set up spikes and stealth rocks because those things are good naturally i mean the spike rocks you can't i mean the spike rocks you could probably go without let's be honest oh we need you the rocks though the we rocks. need the rocks though but they might serve as a little bit of a, of, of a crutch i suppose 
if yeah. you're a Uber player. If if we're if we're crutching on uh, chip damage, then uh, we might get into a bad situation. Yeah, like talk about chip damage. You want to talk about chip damage? Yeah, mm -hmm. you go with uh, you go with Pharaoh Seed on that because chip damage is what it means in these. And like when you tie it down to the wire, these games get very very down mm -hmm. to the wire with the with the chip damage, and that's why you got to have the chip damage. You see, exactly. I, I know. I came in clutch this game. It did. I don't, as I, we'll yeah, see I would here. know. I would know. But uh, right, I don't want to spoil the results, so I'm just gonna let this play for a little bit because we both just gonna take some turns setting up some uh, hazards. And then he gyro balls me, Ridiculous. which makes sense. Uh, coughing is slow, but so is Pharisee, so it's not doing a whole lot of damage. Well, uh, and then boom, guys, what did we say about chip damage? Right there. It's Look not at that. important. It's not important. I don't know. I it, I think it might be. I think 37% uh, on the ponytail might be pretty good. I think what you uh, meant to say is it's not important. I my tongue might have slipped. Uh, yeah. Team manager. Yeah, yeah. Your position might slip. Uh, too. no, no comment. <laughs> no comment. I'm referring um, to B. I'll tell you what I'm thinking. I'm thinking I see a fire move, and I don't want Pharisee to sit in there and just die. So I'm getting him Hell out. No. I'm getting Get him, him out, out and soaking up toxic spikes with Nidoran M. That's a clutch play right there. Terrible strategy, but I understand what you're going <laughs> for here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, d I don't want those uh, those poison barbs poking into my team. No, no. Of course you don't. And uh, that one hurt. And you see what I'm saying? Yikes. It's you unfortunate, can't. guys. We can't save them all. Right, exactly. Nidoran M goes down, now, putting us in a 5 If he six, sends in what I think he's going to send in, this might be either a win or a loss. Depend, depends. What does Mr. President think I'm going to send in? I'm I'm just going to wait and see. Let's, let's see. Okay, okay. Let's see who you send in next. Team manager, week. any predictions? Uh, no comment. Okay. I throw let's in... See. Boom! I knew it was coming! Totodial. You know we got the priority move. We know we can hit first with that chip damage. Huh? Chip damage is We're hitting important. Him. Like I've, I've been trying to drill this into Quincy's head since day one. That chip damage is the number one <laughs> form of damage. And if he doesn't implement it better, he's going to lose his spot in the rankings. And, and I almost did. Him finally taking some action. But I didn't this he week. He almost did. No, sir. Watch this. Boom. So Super effective gone. as it should be. Done. The head chopped Chip damage, off. who needs it? Exactly. Coughing? We're up to coughing now? Yep. And we're going to... Um, um, he suicide bombed. Ridiculous. Uh, this was a little bit of a shocker in the un game. Unpredictability. I don't mm -hmm. know what rank this is anymore. Yeah. I'm just going to. I'm I, just um, going to put it lightly. My heart sank a little bit when Toted I went down to one percent. But well, on it's the upside, you didn't use the. Um, it's because you didn't use his. Um, his uh, his mega splash. That's why. It's like prize move. You're, I, all the pros are supposed to use that move, and you didn't do it. I did not That's equip mega weird. splash this week, and that is a mistake. No, you didn't. And it shows, too. But you know what we did equip, Mr. President? What? Focus Sash, we so equip? we're alive. Uh, that's well, not a move that he has. It's an item, actually. Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But All that right, means... Go show, uh... That means, guys, we can still take out Clink and Roggenrola with Totodile. So that's good if, news for if me. If we have the patience, if we have the patience, then by God, I don't know if we do. It... It will require some patience, but I'm just going to let now, this Spring play Pig out. is going to be up for a bad start here. Spring Pig is going to get smoked, I think. Mm -hmm. And if he doesn't, that's the name of the game, right? What's the name of that, guys? What just happened? Chip damage? Smoke, smoke Chip, damage. Damage. Chip yep. damage. Name of the game smoke right on. there. Smoke, it's actually Smoke Mon. Um, major misplay. This was all my fault, team Skull manager. I am, back out. I'm sorry. I, I, will, I will mention uh, something here. This is where Quincy, as usual, got very impatient. And true mm -hmm. story, there was uh, he was listening to some very, very upbeat, aggressive metal music at the time. I can hear I, it from my room. I can I hear it from my office. I told him to mute it because it is proven that people who listen to fast-paced, aggressive music will make more rash, poor decisions and will rush into things. And I and told him to turn it off and <sighs> yeah. think through his decisions, look at the numbers. But, of course, he didn't. And uh, it almost cost and he us kept, big. He yeah. kept crying to me about not wanting to play this game since he's got a bum leg, he's got he's got a <laughs> bum elbow, he got a bullet wound, he got his leg cut off, he got his eyes ripped out, he's got no nose, no eyes, no teeth, no mouth. But I said, play, play anyways, because that's what you were here to do. And you know what you did? You won. And that's what we need from you. I, I okay. won, but I did throw the Solosis into a shadow ball, which cost us our our little scolo scoliosis guy. Not not the best play. Not the it best was play, not the we, best play. The heavy we'll metal music did not support me. Well, it's, I thought it was one baby metal. A kill. It was it was pretty heavy. No, it I, was it was pretty baby. I thought I couldn't carry it. I couldn't carry it. Well, in your in your you know four years, Mr. President, I'm sure that right. 
the, your level of metal has, you know, been desensitized. Mm -hmm. Well, you might be correct, but I also think I know weak mindsets when I see it. You know where it is a high level of not metal? Saying, not saying this is an example of one, but it could be. It might be. Go on. What is a high level of metal is what is on the field right now. Two steel types. Uh oh. Uh, Mr. President rem remembers this matchup well. One he's faced many yep. times. Yep. And mm -hmm. one I did not have the foresight to play correctly around. You all, you all, you already know what I do during a match like this to win. You already know. Mm -hmm. And I, I didn't do what you, you would have done. You didn't. You didn't. Instead, do I it. threw I... out spikes again, and he subbed. <sighs> well, you see, I don't see why that wouldn't work because the frog, I think, is three percent more resistant to flame, and you have water, and that should have worked. Right, but, but this considering like the numbers, if you carry the two, yeah, yeah, I can, I can see the algorithms in my head telling me why that wouldn't work. Yeah, uh, in fact, I think that play might have been a little dog buggered on my end. Well, I was gonna say the same thing, except um, not as like, not as um, not as brash. Well, more brash, less uh, humane. Oh, oh, ugh. Ugh. let's not let's not go there. Let's right. keep the humanity you don't want, you don't in want the game. This was a humanity level game, and we want to keep it human. Well, um, as I've been saying since day one, Geodude has the, the prime abilities here that we need to win this fight. He does. And that prime ability is sturdy. I think we have sturdy on him. And it's going to save I us. I wouldn't call it that, but okay. I'm thinking this you know, guy is going to go for like a gear shift, giving him plus attack and defense and speed or something. Mm -hmm. And then mm -hmm. Clink, John and John, is just going to give us a little clinking. You know, well, I wouldn't call it that. I'd call it way. more of. Um, I, I'm sorry. Again, I was going to get inhumane. Yeah. Let's, uh, let's get let's get back let's get back to this game. All right. Let's yeah. Analyze so it. Let's, yeah. No clinging. Now remember the I frog. See... Remember what I said about the frog, right? You remember. Fire. It's got Three percent resistance to fire. Now, if you pull up the water on this attack, it might be a good play. However, <laughs> that's only if the other three percent is canceled out by the rock. Do you understand me? Well, good thing we have the rocks there then. It's a good um, thing we have the rocks there. And we have the rocks with uh, day one. a nice little earthquake. He steel beams oh. us! Mm -hmm. Steel beams you. that 3% Not... hurt? Bad? It did. Oh, and he healed, of course. Mm -hmm. And now he's going yep. into a little bit of a sleep talk, rest, um, RNG kind of play here. And we're just going to keep earthquaking. Okay. I'm going to take a quick hit of this bong. Go on. <laughs> now, if, if you guys pay attention uh. here... Uh, the Midwestern Warriors clink wake up on turn two of sleep, or turn three, whatever, however you want to look at it, uh, for rest. This is all wrong. Well, Which is how it normally wrong. works. This is not what I would do, but, you know, this yeah. isn't me. So. Well, you're not is, watching me. This so. is why Geodude got clapped here, because I was in control, and not the you team didn't manager. Do, yep. You didn't do the strat. Didn't and do the strat. because he forgot that his sleep was up. He, he forgot that he his did sleep forget, was up. And that meant we Anybody could Anybody would have not forgotten that. Get him, get him out. You know, this is ridiculous. I'm not now sure up against this. how things would have changed in the end if he didn't forget, but they, they would not have ended as well, I don't think. So we get the I kill on the clink, no. and then Geodude, our sturdy rock to stand on, is gone. Our house of Geodude and is Don't no we more. all need a rock to stand on? We do. Don't we all? So Eevee and comes the, out clutch. Yeah, Eevee comes out, hits a nice little return on the duck. Well, hits I'd a quick on... attack on Frederick. Priority well, I'd moves? More, I'd call that more of a pig. Boom. And then rock, 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 rock. I call that out. more of a octagon, but that's just my presidential analysis. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, he is kind of octagonal. Well, I wouldn't say octagonal. I'd say more just um, part of the minority group. Oh, uh, uh. we're gonna keep moving. We we're gonna that? hit that guy with a. Uh, no, Should we fine. cut that? No, Mr. President, we don't need to cut anything. Okay, we're gonna okay. double edge him and. Get taken out by an earthquake, I think? No, we don't Ooh. get taken out by the earthquake. You just barely. You just but barely. But we do get taken by out by his of... rocky helmet damage. By the skin of your pubes, you just barely do it. Yeah. And by, by God, skin. I knew you had it in you. Good. And it, it had a little bit to do with the chip damage, I think. It was a rocky road, but it was a road we walked. It, yeah. The chip damage helped us. Well, I walked. I walked it, mainly. I, I was carried by a team manager. We, yeah, we carried him. Yeah. About. Yeah. I um, would say so. Team manager, what do you think of this game overall and the Laddie Daddy's performance? Um, in comparison to last week. Better, but there were still times where you made really bad decisions, but the other mm -hmm. team just happened to 
make one more bad decision or yeah. one more misplay. I want to um, say so if, it's all uh, about. So if the if the Midwestern Warriors had not uh, miscounted their their sleep turns, I think that either could have been their game or uh, a much closer differential. I'm not sure how I would have clutched that up if uh, Clink popped off there. For sure. Yep. And I guess moving into next week, biggest things to work on is just taking things slower, not listening to power metal while yeah. playing. Yeah, yeah. Learn and the map. Just looking at the spreadsheets and thinking. Learn the map from one. Biggest yeah, the, thing. I noticed, I noticed your good. crosshairs are all over the place. I don't well, know what you're yeah. aiming at most of the time. I don't have a so, crosshair anymore. I don't use it. Mem yeah, memorize the map. Memorize the map. Big mm -hmm. thing. I mean, this is a competitive game we're talking. You, do, you can't is. even do the liberties of memorizing the damn map. And next week, guys, we're going to need to be extra competitive. Because you know extra. who we face? We yeah. face the Jamestown Joltix. Interesting. Who gave the uh, the Goldenrod Goomies a run for their money in week one, I believe. I heard about that. Uh, Soul crushing. It, Soul crushing. It shook the earth, that game did. And I think we'll need to be on our A game if we want to stand up to them. Both players gave it their all, and... Um... It just turned out the way it did, I would say. I would say, mm -hmm, we, mm -hmm. you know, they need tactic, strategy, and good thing we have all those things. Yeah. Uh, any closing thoughts from team manager? Um, good job. Thank you. Uh, we could do a lot better. A lot of things to learn from this. Mm -hmm. And anyone watching this in the league, uh, you know, look at this game. Use it as an example of how to beat the gears and the surprise self-destructs, and the uh, springy pig. Don't get springed on. The springy like pig us. was actually pretty scary. Not gonna lie. Yeah. It was. Yeah, and that the gears. Was. Be prepared for that sleep talk gear play. Mm -hmm. Well, yeah. being in this industry for two years has taught me one thing, and that is to avoid the spring pig, okay? Okay, <laughs> yeah. people listening out there, you avoid the spring pig. As alluring as it is, you will... Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. You don't go near it. Yeah. Uh, last word for me, I think, would be to... um. Honestly, watch out for the Midwestern Warriors. The number 18 on the power rankings, but uh, he, he has some good strats, and he will... I wouldn't be surprised if he takes a game from someone next week, or this week, or whatever. Anyway, that's it from the Laddie Daddies and Mr. President and the team manager. We're all signing off. Have a good week, guys. Peace out. Goodbye.